Hello everyone and welcome to Brick Cats. My channel is for anyone who enjoys custom LEGO creations, likes saving money, and or those looking to get into custom building. If you're a fan of my channel or are interested in supporting what I do, please consider leaving this video a like, subscribing, or leaving a comment. Each like, subscription, and comment helps others find my channel and I greatly appreciate it. Today I'm doing something a little different and taking a close look at official set number 42179, the Technic Planet Earth and Moon in Orbit, which is a contraption known as an orrery. I thought this was initially a LEGO idea submission as the orrery, but maybe not. In any case, the reason I'm doing this video is because there are some fairly glaring inaccuracies here that I feel LEGO completely whiffed on. In this video, I'm going to go over a few of these and try and get the set to better represent the realities of modern science. First, of course, the Sun and the Earth's locations are reversed. Second, the Moon is well known to be made of cheese. Third, the Earth, as you can see, it's rotating here. We all know the Earth doesn't rotate. That's just crazy. And finally, the Sun is much too large and is also the wrong shape because the Sun is a circle. It's completely two-dimensional, so we're going to have to cut that down to size. Well folks, I think we did it. We fixed the LEGO orrery. Let's take a look at some of the changes I made. I replaced the spherical Earth representation with this 2x6 tile. It's even nicely labeled for us in case there was any doubt. And the tile is just much more accurate to the actual shape of the Earth. I think we can all agree. The moon, since it's made of cheese, is now represented with a cheese slope. And finally, the sun is now disc-shaped. Unfortunately, I didn't have a Technic disc piece, which would be more accurate, but I am happy with this for now. Most importantly, we now have the Earth at the center of the solar system, and by implication, at the center of the universe. And now, if I operate this, you can see that the disc flips around, which gives us night and day. The Earth is in a fixed location. And I guess I would have to do something to make the moon orbit the Earth, but not very important. It might as well just stay there all the time anyway. Thanks as always for watching this modification video of the LEGO Planet Earth and Moon in Orbit set. If you built this model you have something to share that I left out, or have a question about something I didn't cover, please leave your thoughts below in the comments. Remember to leave the video a like and a comment, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Instagram if you haven't already. Each like, comment, and subscription helps increase the channel's visibility, and I greatly appreciate your support. I hope to see you back next time, and I wish you a very happy April 1st.